In our poster we share relevant and important rules for information design in dashboarding and in this case, in this video, I like to share my thoughts about providing comments and recommendations within dashboards and it is very beneficial and important that controlling and BI departments use this functionality really to provide additional insights and think about adding value. Not only that they just share the data, but also think about recommendations and comments. So what are our thoughts about that? I'd like to share first the way how we comment. Here's a little example of Shirley and Lucy. This is exactly how we are not willing to provide comments and recommendations. It's a long text. Um, if you just have a look at it, we see that the conclusion is provided at the end and then the first argument, the second argument, the third argument. I think this is not the way how we should think about providing comments. It should be somehow a way like this, directly straightforward in the way that we say, well, the storyline is, hello Shirley, I hate you and these are the reasons. So this one, two, three, four, or one, two, three. This is exactly how we should comment. And then there are different ways how we actually implement it in our dashboard. There's the first thing, there's the free comment area. So if we place um, diagrams on the left hand side and add some additional comments and recommendations on the right hand side without interconnection between them or we can think about those connected comments. I think this is a really uh, the, the best thing so that we really know okay at that specific point for example in the second quarter we have this or that and then it's the textual components and the visualizations are interconnected. I think this is a very good one. Or you can make comments in a table so then it's also a really high information density possible. How could that look like? For example, here in the uh, tool board, we see also our tile structure plus additional information on the right hand side. So the free commenting is also written back to the database. So this is quite powerful. And also here the connections is also possible with add-on tools so that you have um, those small numbers and the connection between the visual and the textual element. So it's possible, just we need to start doing it. 